Nigerian Bank Guarantee Trust Bank has injected over 2.5 billion shillings in its local operations, which it hopes will endear more Kenyans and to also attract Kenyans in this particular market. Here's now is Michael Karanja with that report. The success of West African financial institutions in Kenya over the last six years is mixed. And with Guarantee Bank joining the fray, analysts will be keen to assess its performance in a market dominated by homeboys like Equity, KCB Group and Cooperative Bank. However, the bank says it has a different strategy to record success in this market. The way we intend to do it is quite simple. First, you have to develop a bit of a, you have to make the balance sheet a bit bigger, which means you have to play some retail. You will then also have to play maybe high end of SME, high end of commercial and some corporate and give yourself a stronger balance sheet. For Nigeria's six most profitable bank is not about gaining top spot. It's about changing the banking experience in Kenya and the rest of the East African region. Guarantee Bank is Nigeria's largest lender by market capitalization at 5 billion US dollars. With a 2.5 billion shilling equity injection, the bank hopes to tap on the emerging lending opportunities in East Africa with an eye on the oil sector. GT Bank will be taking on established players in the market such as KCB, Equity, Barclays and Standard Chartered Bank in its pursuit of breaking into the tier 1 group of banks. 20% of the bank's business is in the upstream business of Nigeria's vast oil sector and has eyed opportunities to replicate the same in Kenya. I think it's developing in Kenya and that just like everywhere else in the world there's going to be a learning curve. What we will try to do is use our local franchise to bridge that learning curve. Retail banking is also a big ticket item the bank is hoping to cash on as well as innovation such as social banking. Though expansion is not its primary concern, the bank hopes to be in Tanzania in the next two years building on its Kenyan and Ugandan operations. Right now what we're doing is actually putting the five-year strategic plan for this bank which will guide how we lead our lives from now into 2018 which will be done in a couple of weeks. Michael Karanja, KTN Business.